Hi guys, Betsy here with Unique Paper 15. Thanks so much for stopping by today and Happy New Year's! Happy 2018! I hope everybody had a wonderful holiday season and is looking forward to some really great things for 2018. I know I am. I am starting the year off with a bang so I wanted to get out a couple uh, haul videos, share some happy mail, and then I'm going to be doing a couple giveaways, uh, little ones, so stay tuned if you're interested in that, but let's get to it because this is going to be long. This is going to be part one, I believe, of three videos, so let's get to it. Okay, so the first thing I got was from Doodlebugs Washington. I think that's how they call it. Yeah, Doodlebugs WA, which is Washington. And I got some really cool stuff there. Um, I always love the way they wrap their things. So the first thing I got was that My Favorite Things Dynamics. It's the cross stitch tag die. And I cut it apart and I've just been using this little, I guess, circle piercer kind of thing. And I'm sorry I don't have anything in front of me to show you the um, piercing that I've been doing cross stitching, but I can show you, I post on Instagram actually, the tag size. This is just, if you just want to do the tag. So that's the tag size. You can see it's a decent size tag, bigger than um, one of their blueprint sketch ones. And that's another one. So very nice size tag. Now, I also have been doing some tags with the piercing for cross stitching. I'm getting the hang of it, but it's a lot of fun. Uh, to be honest, I've been doing the cross stitching in bed at night when I'm just kind of trying to calm down and uh, you know relax. It's very soothing to do the cross stitching. Um, just you know, poke your little piece of paper and then take it to wherever it is you relax and do some cross stitching. So I know that Paper Smooches also has a cross stitch die, but this is the only one I could get my hands on. So that one, and then I went ahead and I got the big Mama Elephant's Thanks die, or stamp. Um, let me see, I think I might have something stamped out. Yes, I do, okay. I did it in Memento and in um, watercolor type of ink. So it's very large, you guys. I thought this was gonna be a smaller stamp. This is the watercolor version I did. I'm just trying to play around with it. But it's very, very big. So you can see, I mean, it's a large stamp and it lends itself to so many techniques. You could do, uh, you know, the, uh, the ink embossing, the dry resist kind of thing, watercolor, Copic, pencil. It's just a beautiful um, stamp. And then I also have the, uh, my favorite things, thanks die that I actually, the thanks letters almost measure up to this perfect. So there's a lot of opportunities with this stamp. So got that one. And of course it has some like embellishment type of stamps. You have some loose leaves here that are empty and filled. And then I really, really appreciate you. You're the absolute best for being you and sending all my gratitude. I like that. I think this is just enough. It makes the card. You don't need much more. So. I got those two things from Doodlebugs Washington. And then, of course, they always send something free. They're very generous. And this time it was um, a little Christmas wreath from Doodle Pops. Very cute. One of my girlfriends had sent me that one time. So now I have two. And sometimes they give you a code. So there's that. <clears throat> okay. And they always do this little wrapping like this. I think it's really cute. Presentation is everything. Okay, so then uh, from Little Inker Designs, I forgot to show you guys this one on my last haul video, so I'm showing you now. I got this one. My friend Julie had made me a card with this. I'm looking up above to see where it is. It was the cutest card. It's up here somewhere on my ceiling. Um, but it's the I'll Be Brief stamp set, and I think it is adorable. So I finally got it. The little rhinoceros, the alligator, the bear, and then the briefs. It says, congratulations, sending hugs, I'll be brief, love you, hello, a little bow tie there. Thank you, good luck, 
get better soon and happy birthday and I actually just made a card for one of my dear friends who's been quite ill and this is it I'll be brief let me see here let me cover that up okay so let me cover up the name but I put the little rhinoceros he's supposed to be laying down so I put you know rest listen do nothing repeat steps one through three so I think this is a really cute stamp set. You can make a little card, you can make a big card, but um, I'm really excited to have that stamp set. Okay, so now I want to show some holiday cards and um, some Happy Mail and then more products. So this is a card I got from my friend Karen and I didn't show this in my Instagram post because I actually just got it the other day. But is this not beautiful? Look at all the fleck and the shine in there. It's a large, large card. North Pole, and she put the little Santa gnomes. I love them. And with the mushroom, with the smoke, I love it. Her coloring is amazing. Look at that. I thought she did the shading under the nose here. I love it. Really good job. This is just a very well-made card. And then again, she put the little gnome inside. I think this is a very adorable card. And then look at that. The little Westy dog or Scotty, I think Westy is their proper name. So that. All right, now I want to show you what my friend Kimberly sent. It's a lot. I want to show you guys this. This is hilarious. I waited to open it all the way until I showed it. She says, This is all your fault. I think this is hilarious. Do you guys remember those disposable G strings? Well, some of you got them from me. Um, I'm sure I'm gonna send some more out to some people but look what she did you guys she took the g-strings and she cut them up and she made little underwears to match the stamp is that not clever I think that is so genius friends are like underwear always near you I think this is wonderful and then she sent me the stamp set that she made this with I think that's great so I haven't opened it all the way, but I think that is creativity 101 right there. She's like, I'm not actually wearing these G-strings, but I'll use them in another way. So she gave me the envelope and everything. And is this, yep, this is a card that I can send out if I'd like. I think that is just brilliant. Good job, Kim. I like it. Okay, so there's that. I'm gonna put that back in its sleeve in a second. So very creative. All right, next thing is a pair of socks, actually two pairs of socks. They're not up here. I'm so sorry. I took them on vacation with me and I wore them. So they're in the wash right now, but she sent me some candy cane and some Santa Claus socks that are like knee high. Love them. Been wearing them. Um, she sent me this awesome whimsy stamp. It's a little alpaca. Is he not cute with his little hat on? And it's red rubber. So I got that guy. She made me some really cute tags and then some also some really cute pieces that I could, you know, put in my planner or wherever I'd like. Then she sent me this really cool pocket letter. She's really good at pocket letters. That's kind of how we met was we're like, hey, let's uh, exchange a pocket letter because we we're both new at it. But look, she did this whole sheet and coordinated it perfect. And then on this side, she just filled it with nothing but holiday and winter stuff i think that's beautiful and i'll only open a couple pockets here because i don't want to waste all video on this whole pocket letter let's see she made each one a little envelope let's see oh my gosh gingerbread wooden buttons oh my god that is so cute oh my gosh i know what this is going to go perfect with i'll show you guys here in a minute it's actually going to be in the hall okay then let's open up another one she does the best pocket letters okay and uh, let's do this one behind santa's face okay oh gender bender a charcoal clean for everyone chunk perfectly posh detox what is this oh my gosh it's charcoal detox soap i love that I love that gender bender. I love it. Okay, I'm gonna put that back in there. So you guys get the drift. She does a lot of really cool, unique things in her pocket letters. 
And I need to make another one that's kind of cool like this. But uh, I've been more into the, like, I don't know, those little flip books and things like that. I'm really liking the paper craft thing. So, all right, there's the pocket letter. Very nice. And look at this, you guys. Oh, and the card, sorry. Look at this little box card. Happy holidays. It's one of those little shadow boxes. I love it with all the little bears fishing and skating. Isn't that cute? And all the little snowflakes that she made it out and, and the, the ombre blending. I love it. Okay. So now this is awesome. Look at this book, you guys. It's like wooden with sticks. And it has all those magazine pieces that people fold in those really awesome weaving ways with like a hibiscus kind of flower. It's so soft. Isn't that neat? It's like some type of foam. I don't even know how to describe it. But it's an album. And look at this. This is the coolest thing. It has this parchment in between. And it's like all oh, just organic material. And it has like these pieces of almost like grass in here and that you could put pictures in but I'm gonna actually put cards from you guys and I'm going to like make this my book that I save like all of my cards like my favorite cards my other ones that don't fit on the roof maybe some of my holiday cards and I'm gonna just keep saving them so I never have to get rid of them I love this book is this not so cool you guys I love cool stuff like this thank you Kim I absolutely love this Okay, now um, I'm going to move on to, let's see what's next. Yes, let's do what I got from Tamara, which I did follow her instructions. A lot of her tags said wait until December 25th, so I did. Okay, she sent me this beautiful card that she made, apparently from a stamp set that I sent her, which I think that is so cool. I love that she did such a good job. Everything is so crisp. Okay. now this big bag hi there lovely now you see I didn't open it because it says do not open until December 25th so actually I had to wait until I came home from vacation so let me show you everything she sent you're gonna just be blown away like I was okay, okay. first of all this awesome bag okay she gets the coolest ribbons. It must be a European thing. I don't know, but she has sent me some in pink before, and I love this brand. These ribbons are so amazing. So this one is more of a gray, black, silver mix with the white lace. Love these ribbons. I mean, you get so much. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You get ten rolls of ribbon. It's beautiful. And more ribbon. And why I'm so excited, I'll show you in my haul. These have hearts, and I'm doing a lot of Valentine's Day uh, tags and decorations right now. And this is beautiful ribbon. Very well made. Look at that. One, two, three, four, five different choices. Okay. Also, she sent me these organza bags, which I love. When Brianna sends me stuff, she always puts in the cutest little organza bags. So now I have some. Thank you so much. A mushroom stamp. Is that not so cute? My friend Cynthia also just sent me a mushroom stamp. If you guys remember in my last haul video, Cynthia sent me this, which is so cool. Oops, I'm trying to keep everything. And inside, she also had sent me a mushroom stamp. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. I'm gonna do some really cool mushroom cards coming up soon. So that one. And then check this out. It's a stamp and die set. Is that not cool? So this guy fits this guy, I'm assuming. And these little cute snowmen with the present. He's just hanging out, he's skiing some presents there. And he's just looking, you know, happy. I love it. So I'm going to make some snowmen. She also sent me this guy. Have an utterly cozy winter and Merry Christmas. I did not get any of the auto release when they did that special, like exclusive for Simon's stamp. And then they did the, uh, whatever it was, it was like the two otters. I never got any of them and I absolutely love all otter stamps. So I am so excited to have this. Thank you, Tamara. I absolutely love it. And 
she sent me some doodle bug washi tape with the cute little gingerbread men and the gumdrops and the lollipops and the um, candy canes. Very, very cute. And of course, she got me the matching paper too. Is that not awesome? She always sends the best stuff. Like, she does not mess around. She sends like high quality doodle bug, matchy matchy, everything goes together. I'm sure you guys have seen this paper pack. It has the milk and cookies, the polka dots, the Santa, the red stripes, the cooking stuff with all the cupcakes and cookware, all the candies, the gingerbreads. Um, those are like the, the die cut pieces, the holly, the dots, and the snow. I absolutely love this paper pack. I, I know it was a really big hit this year. I'm gonna save this, okay. This, I am very impressed with. I've been showing it to everybody. She used the, um, what's it called? Pick, nickety pick, I don't know. <laughs> you know that paper pack? Whatever, it looks like sweater stuff. Nickety, nitty, I don't know, that. The red and green, and the gray. Look how she like layered that so perfect. So this card has inspired me to maybe get this die set. I don't know. I just, I think I'd rather just receive these from you guys because it's so cool. But look at the cute little ginger guy from, I think it's um, Sugar Pea, who I have, and I love Sugar Pea. I love the stamp set. But look at this. Ta-da! Is that not perfect? It's, to me, it's magic. I mean, I get the mechanics of it, but to me, no matter how many times I do it, it's still magic to me. Sorry, I'm doing this like above my head. Is that not cute? And again, this is made by her. I love it. I love this card. Okay, and then the last thing she sent, which I am just blown away. Look at the stamp set, you guys. It is huge. It's from Prima. It's called the Sweet Peppermint Slow, uh, Slow, Snow Globe clean stamp and metal dies 81 in here let me show you guys look at this look 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 at everything you get is this amazing or what look at the bear the trees the sprigs the trees the deer that i mean i blown away look at the big snow globe and you can see back there all the dies behind it this must be like the hills that you put inside the globe. Is that not cool? So here's like a little demo of what they've done. I absolutely love it. I cannot wait to make some of these. So heads up, I know that Christmas is over, but winter's not. So snow is still fitting. So some of you might get um, a card like this from me. Okay, so that is from my girlfriend Tamara. Thank you so much. All right, now I'm going to go ahead and do some products um, that I bought, and then we'll do another Happy Mail after that. So, all right, uh, I do wanna show you that I got this from Amazon. I don't know if you guys do their warehouse deals, but I do. And I was looking for some fun foam, and this came up as a recommendation. The sheets are much larger, and it was significantly cheaper. But there's no adhesive on there, and for some reason, I could have sworn they said it was, but you get five sheets of the, that's 8 by 11, right? Yes, 8 by 11. So, I mean, I guess I could cut this up and just use my, um, my liquid adhesive, but I ended up getting this for a really good deal. It was like $2.47. So, I'm not complaining, but um, I definitely should have read the description. I think I started out with, like, adhesive backed white foam and then there was like an offer then a, oh wait there's an amazon warehouse offer and i went there and i ended up with this but hey that's okay maybe i was shopping too fast which would not surprise me okay now let me show you some other goodies all right these i got from the dollar tree sorry for all the noise guys there's a lot of stuff around me okay I'm going to show you everything. I went to the Dollar Tree a couple weeks ago. I've literally been saving all of this to show you guys. Um, this is eBay, so I'll show you that in a second. eBay, 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 eBay. Okay. So Dollar Tree, I ended up finding manila folders. I was so shocked. Do you guys remember when I was telling you I was having such a hard time finding these guys that were 
you know, affordable, they're more expensive than you realize. So you get 10 in here. And of course, when you're doing those flip book things, those really cool things, you don't use the whole manila, you know, thing. You cut it down, you can make whatever sizes you want, but Dollar Tree. So I'm really excited to see these are there. So I'm gonna stock up on those and maybe send some of you some if um, you guys wanna try those flip books that I love so much, or I don't know flat books maybe I should call them a flat book because they're not really a flip book I don't know and then they had these for nail art I got two so I'm going to show you really quick I mean quick really close they're little 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 bows let me see if I can zoom do you see that it's like pink leopard black like pink zebra black kind of like checkers and then pink and diamond now I know these are meant for your nails but again I'm not a nail art wearer. So I thought these would be so cute on cards. Like, um, for example, this little card right here, you know, if it was a girl gingerbread, you could put like a little bow there, or, you know, there's so many things you could put a bow on, but you guys get the drift. And especially for Valentine's Day, I think bows go really nice for Valentine's Day. So you get a ton of them, 10 pieces, a dollar, and they're nice, they're very hefty. So Dollar Tree. And then I also got this paper pack, um, 36 pieces. And I know it's not thick, like, you know, 80 pound cardstock or anything, but let's see. I didn't open it yet. I mean, this is good just for backgrounds, you know? So it looks like you get a few of each design. But what caught my eye was that leopard. Oh, that's cute for spring. That's cute. That's always cute, dots. And there's the leopard. That's what caught my eye, that pink leopard. I thought that was really cute. My mind's really like in Valentine's Day mode, so Dollar Tree, can't go wrong. Okay, and then, let me, oh God, I almost spilled my coffee. Okay, so eBay, I got a couple things. I've been shopping a lot on eBay again. I got these cute little, like, clippy things um i've seen some of you guys get them and some sent to me and i didn't know where to find them so i finally did and they're like empty kind of like clip oh god empty clips but they're so cute and they really do clip like strong and they have them in a whole rainbow of colors so i think this is a 12 pack and i believe i paid three dollars so those are so cute so be expecting to get some of those in your happy mail and then I just got some planner stickers. These are like um, candy dessert kind of things. And they come in a cute little sealable bag. And then more. I got some British ones. I was thinking of my girlfriend, Lisa. She lives in London. So I got some cute little British stickery kind of things. And then a bunch of post-its. This one is just this little girl. And I guess you write the memo in there. So I got a couple of her. The one of the, I think she's supposed to be a bunny. And then, just cute, holding a strawberry. She's saying something. And this one's like on a mission. She's walking somewhere. No problem. I just think these are so cute. So I was going to send some of these out to you guys. I got these plus some other ones. I bought like a whole pack of them, I think, for $4. All together, I think I got 10 post-its in there. So I was very happy about that. And... Let me see what else. Okay, let's do a Happy Meal and then I'll do my next store. Okay, I told you guys this is gonna be a long one. All right, this Happy Meal is from my dear friend Brianna, who you guys all know very well. And she's not feeling so well right now, so everybody needs to keep her in your thoughts. So this was my holiday gift box from her. This beautiful uh, ornament frame decoration with all this glitter here in 2017. A beautiful, huge wooden stamp set with this adorable snowman and a little bird in the house. I love this. With my initial B, wooden stamp, very nice. Look at these socks, you guys. My husband, he was like, what's up with everybody sending you socks? I've gotten socks from a few. Brianna sent me some socks before. Kim sent me some socks. Uh, uh, Jude sent me some socks. Somebody else sent me some socks. They forget who. But, and now Brianna sent me some. I mean, it's the year of socks, right? 
but they're aloe infused you guys air plus ultra comfort i can't wait like after this video is over i'm putting them on are these so cute it's so cold right now it got down to 39 degrees last night so anyways these adorable really i mean just look at that you can almost see how comfortable they are oh my gosh thank you brianna okay let's move on to this bag a whole bunch of goodie bags so i don't want to dump everything out but she packed it with just adorable goodie bags of everything holiday-ish. And I love everything she's put in here. She put decorations. I mean, look at this little clipboard. Hello. I think that's so adorable. Um, a bunch of felt decorations, candy canes, things like that. So I want to keep all these together so I can put them in the right place. These are beautiful. Okay to the next bag okay the next bag is this one right here you see what I mean she just always bags up everything so adorable okay this one she gave me this cute sanitizer Japanese blossom and Kim had sent me some sanitizer as well I keep them right here behind me um because you guys know I'm a germ freak so a lot of times I do I sanitize after um I don't know if you guys do too, when you're gluing something or adhesive something or whatever, and you get like the glitter and the glue and the ugh, on your fingers and you can't, I will take a baby wipe and wash my hands and then I still feel dirty. So I take the sanitizer. So you guys, thank you for these sanitizers. They are like lifesavers up here and a whole entire bag of these adorable star sequins. I actually just made a shaker card with these the other day. I like these ones a lot. They give up a, like a lot of light. Okay, so I'm going to keep these out because I'm going to use them for right now. Okay, next bag. Bag, told you. Little snowflake clip. And look at this. I love these. They're little like reindeer moosey earrings. Hold on. I can't wait to wear these. Maybe I'll wear them tomorrow now that I've done the video. Look at that. Are these so cute? I don't know if you guys follow Attila's Craft on um, Instagram, Etsy, and YouTube, but she's the one that made all those really awesome uh, planner clips that I have that are like those big ceramic clips. Um, this reminds me of something she would make. If you guys don't follow Attila's Craft, you should. She makes some really cool stuff. And if I had my planner clip in front of me right now, I would show you guys, um, but I don't see it. And that worries me because now I don't know where it is. Oh my gosh. Okay, moving on. All right. By the way, we had a major snafu here in the craft room. For those of you who've been with me since the beginning, you remember my husband built the whole room and over the AC unit with like doors to access the AC. Uh-huh. At the end of summer, our AC <laughs> broke and he's like, honey, I'm sorry. You have to take everything out of here. Oh my God. I'm starting from scratch with redecorating my whole entire craft area because I had to strip it bare, but everything's back to good now. But I think I'm going to have to strip it again because we might be moving. Okay. Moving on. She sent me some awesome We Are Memory Keepers uh, adhesive. She also sent me this awesome Jane Davenport acrylic stamp set. Have you guys seen this? I just went to Michael's yesterday and I saw some of the Jane Davenport line. Does anybody have the mermaid markers? If you do, please comment down below if you like them. Um, what, what are they comparable to? Are they worth the money? And also her calligraphy pens. I was thinking about getting one, but I'm not sure. So I was curious if anybody has them. But this is really cool and you can make the eyes the closed eyes the mouth and then these are noses is that not cool i like that all right next another bag of goodies and these are a bunch of little goodies i don't want to spill out but i wanted to show you guys these they're little shaker domes let's see if we can get it to focus that literally have the little shaker stuff inside and there's stickers. Is that so cute? I don't know where she got that, but I absolutely love it. So a bunch of cute little stickers and embellishments and things like that in here. Love those. 
Then she sent a very cute, I think she made this. It's an ornament and it's like a double globe. Is that not cute? And it just packed with glitter. Warmest wishes. And then another one. This is so cute. It, I think she made it. It's just so clever. You usually only see like one side, but this is a double globe, like a double rainbow. Okay. Next, here is the card she made me. And she put this cute little bear like seal on there. So I can just easily open it. And I wanted to show you this. Is she so cute? I forget the name of the stamp company. It's not La La Land. It's, um, oh my God, it's ex escaping my mind right now. But look how she did, like she's ice skating on the ice. Is that not clever? Like she's sitting here, here's the snow, Here, I just love that. And all the candy cane, I mean she just did, her coloring is, I, I, it's the best coloring. So let's see here. She wrote me a really nice letter. And she also sent some beautiful of that sticky fabric, you know, kind of tape, washi tape, or fabric tape I should say, and I can cut it into strips. I think this is beautiful. So those, I'm so happy I'm doing these videos because now I can finally put these cards and everything on display. I've been wanting to show you guys. Okay, almost done. Okay, told you it's gonna be long. All right, she sent me this cute little canvas bag. She sent me some beautiful gold sparkly twine. She sent me some little ornaments here. And then she sent me something that was very near and dear to her heart that she's had for, sorry for the noise, for a very long time. Is this, look at this. It's a glass mushroom with this little mouse. And I wanted to show you guys if it translates on camera. The tail is so crazy. Like it reminds me of like an armadillo or something. Like it, it's so flexible. It's weird. It's so crazy. But anyways, it comes with this little like mouse on top. Is that not beautiful? Oh, I think that's so sweet. So this beautiful glass mushroom that I'm going to put actually in my house. I don't think I'm gonna put it in my craft room. I wanna put it somewhere more on display. So that is what I got from Miss Brianna. So like I said, you guys keep her in your thoughts. She uh, is not feeling so well. Okay, so. Now, moving on. It's going to be a long one. Grab some coffee. Okay, I went to Michael's yesterday. Why? Because I had to meet a co-worker at a store, like right next door. So I figured, oh, I'm near Michael's. I should go. So I did. And they were having a sale, and I had a couple coupons. So why not? All right. I showed you guys that my favorite thing is cross-stitch dye. So I got some of these really cool, they're like DMC threads, but they're different. They're by Prism and they're called Sweet Something Something. And they're like fuzzier threads and they give a really cute look and they're all the like the pastel -y colors. And so I've been doing some things for Valentine's Day and it does look different than regular, is it DMC? Yeah, I think it's DMC thread. Um, it does look different because I had started one tag with the traditional thread and then I started another one with this and it's like puffier. It looks softer. It's really cool. So I got this whole entire pack for $2.99. Really good deal. It's back in the like sewing section at Michael's. They have bigger ones too and tie dye ones and everything. So I basically was there for the clearance and I'll show you what I got. Um, I got this Tim Holtz. Uh, trimmings. You get the gold and the silver. I got this for $1.19. I got these uh, quote chips that are on that like chipboard for the holidays. I got this, I think it came down to $1.49. Really good deal. It's packed with words. I got this one right here, which is the countdown brads. But you could use these all year round for birthdays, for the new year, for anything. So these, I think these also were $1.19. I didn't bring the receipt upstairs, but everything's 70% off, so uh, obviously. 
it's a good deal. Okay, so remember I uh, saw those gingerbread wooden beads that Kimberly sent in the pocket letter? They would go so nice with this. These were on sale. These came down to a dollar, I believe a dollar 49. Um, they were originally five ninety nine. But they're wooden spools and they have this like decorative garland for gift wrapping, for cards. It's on like jute twine and they're like really foamy uh, snowflakes. But look at the spool it comes on you guys. It's reusable. Is that not cool? So I got two snowflakes and I got two gingerbread. That's what I was saying it would match nice with. So this is the gingerbread. And you can see they're really well made. I think that is so cute. So if I happen to go by Michael's again, and there is more of these, I'm gonna grab them. There was other ones besides snowflakes and gingerbread. I forget what they were, but um, these were the two that I really liked. But you guys, go to Michael's. Stock up for next year. I mean, there's no shame in that. Okay, I've got stuff falling. All right, then I got washi tapes. This was in the holiday one for 70% off, but I'm thinking Valentine's Day. I mean, I see the hearts here, the red and white here. You could still do candy for Valentine's Day in this one here. So the only one that's really Christmassy is this one right here, the holiday season, the one that says Christmas, and then I don't know what that one under here is. Let's see. No, just thoughts. So all of this could double for Valentine's Day, which is so nice that they continue with that red pink theme. So it was originally $14.99, obviously 70% off, really good deal. And I'm sorry, how many rolls do you get? Five, you get five of them. All right, then I got these. These come down to $1.19 as well. This is, um, it says happy birthday in two different forms. And I got this for my girlfriend because her birthday is coming up on the 7th. And I'm hoping I can get this out the door and to her close to her birthday. And then this is another one that is unicorns and rainbows. And it says something like holographic. Dreamer's going to dream, be a unicorn, freaking magical sparkle free sparkles very cute right super awesome believe in your dreams so this was a dollar 19 as well and then i found one of these for hanukkah and that's like hard to shop for just so you know so this one again was a dollar 19 and it's beautiful actually it has a beautiful menorah a dreidel a goblet star of david just beautiful things and it says the same thing dreidel celebrate hanukkah etc isn't that beautiful? So one of those was in the bin. And then I got um, just some, I don't know, heart Valentine kind of ribbon. They're already uh, putting everything out for Valentine's Day. But if you see, the hearts are all different shades, which I like, because then I can double it with different colored ribbon. Very cute. Okay, so that was Michael's. And I also ended up getting, um, from, I think it was either eBay or Amazon, these guys here, um, just stickers. I think they are so cute. They're kind of puffy, not super puffy, just, you know, a little puff, but I think they're so cute. I like this type of like illustration, very soft. I like this guy, I like them all. They're so cute. So that, all right. Now, let me see if I'm done with Happy Mail. I don't want to leave anything out and if I, if I have, and you know that you sent me something, it will be in the second video. Sorry guys, I'm just trying to make sure I get everything in here. Okay, now, this is gonna be big. So I'm going to show you two more things. The second thing's gonna take a while, so we'll do it at the end. Um, I ended up getting an order in from Planner Street, and they just had a really big sale. And I got a bunch of, like, like planner stickers. Obviously they, they're like a planner kind of store, but I use their stamps for cards and my planner. They gave me this cute little happy holidays stamp. This is their company, Planner Street. They sent me a little free, we love you stamp. And then these are, or sorry, stickers. 
These are all stickers. These are, I think it's called Unicorn Buddies. Are these so cute? Look at the two little unicorns poking out and then the girls dressing like unicorns. I think that's so cute. So I got one for me, one for my friend. This one I think is called Happy Mail and they have different sizes. So I ended up getting uh, three of those, one for me, two for two friends. I don't, oh, this is Lazy Day. This is, it's called Lazy Day and she's kind of like in her pajamas. I thought this was cute, I got that for a friend. This one is called Good Vibes and she's just chilling with her little animals, I guess. Like the cat on the head, she's holding the fox. Again, difference, and it says Good Vibes. And then this one is just, um, it's called the Peekaboo Weekly and you can put them on your days. I thought those were cute. Very, very cute. So you can put them like on the column for the week of the day. So there's that. Then I got two stamp sets. I got one for my girlfriend's birthday and one for myself. So this one is called the You've Got Mail and it's called Stamp Besties. And I think that's so cute because so many of us have become friends because of the stamping and the card making and Instagram and YouTube and things like that. So I thought this was just so perfect. You can see her there with all her mail and packages, her stuffed animals, the little puppy with the You've Got Mail. He has like a little envelope in his mouth. And then, um, you know, just boxes and little banner kind of things. And then the next one is called Bestie. Sorry if you can hear my dog. I don't know why he's freaking out. I think his girlfriend's outside and he's just dying to go outside. Let's see. Okay, Bestie. I think this is them doing the peace sign. And then... <laughs> Is that like a bear and a fox hugging something? The little arrow, the peekaboo, and then the two girls. I think this is so cute. So one for her, one for me, and then some stickers for me and a few of you guys. So there's that. Okay, here's what's gonna take the longest and then we'll be done with this video. You guys are like, wow, that's a lot of stuff. I know, I know. I've been dying to like get all of this on camera, but it's been busy, I went on vacation, my craft room has been a wreck, and now I'm finally filming. Okay, so Freckled Fawn uh, advertised that they were doing a warehouse sale, and so is Studio Calico. So I have a second order coming in from uh, Studio Calico, which I'll do in the next video, but this is Freckled Fawn. It just came in today, I have not opened it, so I wanted to show you guys everything that I got. I think I think I paid $39.99. I could check my receipt, but I'm pretty sure that's what it is, $39.99. So you don't know what you're gonna get. They just say, hey, we're moving. We have a ton of stuff. Do you want like a whole entire box? So here we go. This is some type of, it looks like traveler's notebook. And sorry if this paper is loud, guys. All right. So traveler's notebook. It looks like this whole thing comes open. And then, of course, you put, you know, your your um, page holders and everything inside there or paper. These are becoming very popular. Oh, my gosh. Y you can smell the leather. That is cool. You can actually smell the leather. I wish I had smell -o vision It smells like a brand new, like pair of boots or belt or something. Very cool. So it has this nice little doohickey here. Good for Valentine's Day, right? Pink and white. All right. What is this thing? This is screaming at me. I see $5. Hello. You have earned dough bucks. $5. Use your special discount code during your discount time. Details on back. Okay, so I can use this the 1st to the 31st. Oh, okay, five bucks off. How about that? That's cute. Okay, see, this is what I was talking about. Our warehouse move easier. We hope you enjoy your warehouse box. And make lots of beautiful things. Make sure to tag us. We have included a wood card as a thank you gift. We appreciate your support and trust in our company. You guys, when companies do this, when they move or they're offering warehouse boxes, if you can afford it, do it. You guys, they give you so much stuff, like more than you paid for. It's I love it. So this is the wood card. It's like balsa wood. Yay, high five, way to go. This is cute. Very cute. I'd actually like to make that into a card and give that to somebody. 
I like that. Okay. Then it looks like some washi tapes. All right. Let me put this here. Okay. So this one is beautiful memories and hearts. You are a maze. That's cute. This is just like what you see here, this little plaid, like greenish kind of color, green and navy. Sorry for the blur, you guys. This one is um, a bunch of floral type of, let me see, see, flowers. This one is, hey you, the good life, having fun, blah, 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 repeats. This one is like some type of orange pointy chevron arrowy thing. This is a bunch of, oh, it's like labels, date, time, blah, blah, dates, you know, planner stuff. Okay. Now let's move on. Oh my God. I can still smell this traveler's notebook. Whew. It is fresh. Okay. Let's open the second bag. Remember guys, everything you're seeing, $39. And I believe that included shipping. And the sad thing is, is I ordered it when we were on vacation. I got the email and now because my bank account's like bloop, 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 bloop. I'm like, I delete the emails as soon as they come out. I'm like, no, 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 I can't read it because if it's a good deal, I go for it. So I'm literally banning myself from my emails until, I don't know, next month maybe. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's just do this. These look like Brad's. They are epoxy button stickers, eight pieces, and they're very thick. So you can see they're just like a mix of like fall. Yeah, I love fall, blah, blah, blah. This is, okay, there you go. A delightful set of rubber shapes, and you guys can see what it says, summer bliss, love at first sight, hey you, family time. And they're literally just what they say. They're like, they feel like erasers, but they're like little rubber type of, embellishments. These are really cool to put on cards. They are a great embellishment. Um, paper clips with heart little shapes. Very cute. Like that. I love all freckled fawn stuff. I love freckled fawn. I have ever since I found them. Um, a little wood shape that's florally. Wouldn't that be pretty just to put like on, um, so you did some ink smushing on a white card and then just put this boom out the door beautiful card and they could do whatever they wanted with that these are more clips but this part is epoxy very cute just random little shapes rainbows etc next is more clips in the arrow shape all very colorful I do like that about their products. They're very well made and they're always very colorful. It looks like we have a bunch of acetate, 18 large acetate dollies. Doilies, sorry, hello, doilies. That's what they look like. That's cool. I've never seen anything other than a paper doily. Now it's an acetate doily. That'd make a cool embellishment. Okay, enamel stickers in this like diamond-esque kind of shape there. I'm sure there's a technical word for that shape. Don't know. Pointy diamond looking thing. Paper clips. Very nice. It's like the year of the paper clips, right? Everybody was doing paper clips this year. More um, enamel stickers. 49 of them. What is that? Hold on. I want you guys to see this. Does it look like the white has something inside of it? I think it does. Oh, it does. It's like filled with paper. You see that? I wonder if they shake. Sorry, did that make you dizzy? That's cool. It's not just white, it's actually filled with something. Okay, that's clever. Okay, 23 foiled epoxy stickers. You're mixing it up here. So you get some foil and some epoxy. You see what I mean? How all their stuff is so bright and colorful. Like, None of their stuff is ever bland and dull. They really have nice stuff. It's like worth all the money you spend, which it's very affordable by the way. Okay, 15 foil cork autumn stickers. So it just says, oh you guys, that's a really good idea. What if we did some of that like gilding on our cork paper with our stamps? If you have the dyes for leaves and pumpkins, 
You know, that would be really cool. That's a really good idea to save some money. Thought for next year. Okay, this is chipboard, 19 pieces. Remember guys, everything I've been showing you, $39. Very cool, I like chipboard. Um, glitter stickers, 89 pieces. What is this? Don't know, it looks like some type of uh, epoxy arrow sticker thing. I do like their little washi tapes. They usually have like phrases. Oh no, that's Studio Calico that has the phrases. This is just the washi tape. But you get four pages. This is perfect for my Valentine's Day stuff. And a bunch of alphabets. It says you get two sheets of vellum alphabets. These are my favorite. I have these in black and white, orange and white, and now this. I love these. These are my favorite. These chipboard sayings. These are my favorite. They say everything. Sweet days, vacation time, explore the city, beach life, so very happy. Um, they say a ton of different things. I absolutely love these chipboard um, sentiments. Oh, this is cute. 38 chipboard. Look at that. Those are nice and thick and colorful. You guys, they still have more. If you guys are interested, go to Freckle Fun. Okay, 10 pieces of word wood chips. Let's see what they say. There you go. Love, crazy set, hello, lovely, awesome, amazing. You guys know what these are. Oh, these remind me of April. Um, 12 pieces of foamy sticker cameras. Those are cute. I'm sure I know where I'm gonna give these. Okay, 36 puffy stars in different colors. Very, this like says boy all over it. Boy's birthday card, boy something. Next, more of those crazy white filled thingamajigs. I think those are cool. Okay, these ones are more puffy stars, but like in a metallic-y kind of look. I love that teal. God, that teal is pretty. Again, more stars. This is really silver metallic-y. Oh, I wanted to buy these when they came out. I never did. How funny I ended up with them. Look at these chrome puffy stickers, you guys. This chrome is like screaming. Is that cool? Perfect for Valentine's Day. It's like so chrome. I don't know if it's translating on camera. It's very shiny. And the same in gold. Awesome. Then more arrow uh, paper clips that would match a lot of that stuff you guys just saw. And, oh, a traveler's book to put in our traveler's notebook and another traveler's notebook. So we got this one here and this one. Let's open this guy up. I wonder if this was like an extra because I knew it came with one notebook. I did not know about two. Okay, here's the second one. Uh, here's the little bandilio thing. This one does not have that little holder. It does have a pen holder though. Oh, I'm doing it backwards, guys. Okay. Is that, no, it's not Velcro. It was just like stuck together. This one has holders for things. This one's a little more impressive. This one's a little more, you know, traditional and basic. I like that they have those. So let's go ahead and put this together. Brianna sent me um, a little mini traveler's notebook that she actually made a couple months ago, and I love it. I've actually never made one. You guys are probably screaming at me. That's not how you do it. I don't know. Let's figure it out. Right? Isn't that how? Is this book maybe not for this? Am I destroying it? Let's see. This guy here. Isn't that how you do it? Is this for a second book, maybe? Oh, I should YouTube how to do this. Okay. So I think that's the concept. And then you could tuck this in here if you wanted to keep this out of the way. I just want to make sure it would fit. Yes, it would fit. Let's see. If you guys are into Traveler's Notebooks, uh, they have a lot of freckled fun. I'm destroying this book. Let's see. But once it's in, you'll never know. Oh my God, just get in there. Are you supposed to put the page first? 
Okay, I think I'm just going to cut this page off. Oh, there we go. Okay, now that I've just completely <laughs> destroyed that cover. Okay, you'll never know. All right, so I guess people like draw, sketch, doodle, and then you can add a second book. Um, so that's really cute though. And it has a little pen holder. So I definitely am going to be looking for homes for these guys because I'm not really a traveler snowboard person. Okay, I am going to be giving some things away. Uh, do you guys remember this? It's my cute little mushroom vacuum. Yeah, cute, right? Okay, I bought two to give away. I'm going to be giving two away. So if you guys would like one, go ahead and comment down in the bottom of the video. What was your favorite thing? I don't care. You don't have to say a secret word. You don't have to put a message. Just tell me what your favorite thing was. And if you're interested in the mushroom, put mushroom. Well, I guess that is a secret word, right? <laughs> Just so I know you're interested in the mushroom. So um, the mushroom vacuum, they are really, really a lifesaver. I'm so excited that I got it and I use it for everything. I mean, it is small, but it does. It cleans up your craft area really nice. So if you guys are interested, like I said, put down below what your favorite part of this whole entire haul was and mushroom next to it so I know you want it. And if you guys are interested, check out Freckled Fawn. And in my next video, I'm going to be showing you everything I got from Studio Calico because they're doing the exact same thing. Check out some of your favorite stores. A lot of them are doing like um, year-end closeouts, warehouse sales, overstock sales, things like that that you can get phenomenal deals on. So, all right guys, that's it. I hope everybody's staying warm and having a great new year so far. Thanks for sharing some time with me. And if you have not subscribed yet, please do give me a thumbs up if you like the video, but definitely come back for more. Thanks. Bye-bye.